Welcome back at Dream Mac Winter 2011. I'm sitting here with Mana. How are you doing? I'm doing actually pretty, pretty good. Uh, I just passed my group uh, uh, when I was losing 2 0 to Nighten, so I feel pretty good about it. And how did the, the groups, how did the matches go in the, in the, the second group stage? Uh, my first game was versus Nighten. Uh, I lost 2 0 pretty convincingly, I would say. Uh, then I played Kass. Uh, I was leading 1 0, uh, but the final score was 2 1 after pretty good and long games. And the last game was versus Titan, uh, PvP as well, and I won 2-0. You had to win 2-0? Yeah, I had to win 2-0 because if I would have won versus Titan 2-1, I wouldn't pass the group. Oh, so it was pretty uh, pretty stressful? Yeah, it was like very, very stressful because, you know, I really wanted to pass my second group stage to get to the playoffs and when I managed to win 2-0, I was extremely happy. Right. Um, going back uh, into uh, yesterday, you had... Uh, what kind of group did you get? It, it seemed that it wasn't the toughest group out there. Uh, I think compared to the other groups uh, in the first group stage, uh, I had one of the easiest ones. And yeah, I, I passed it pretty easily without losing any map, so... No, no shame in there. Yeah. So, uh, what's your current status? What's your favorite uh, matchup? Uh, favorite matchup, it will be still PvT. PvT? And your worst? Uh, my worst, I think PvP. PvP. And you just won? PvP versus Titan, which was somebody that was beating up Huck, but <laughs> it's still your worst matchup. Yeah, it's still my worst matchup because uh, I think in PvP you don't need that much skill to win. There can be a lot of upsets uh, in, in uh, playing the, the matchup, so uh, I'm not really sure if, if it was Titan playing so well that he won versus Huck, or Huck playing that bad, or maybe me playing that good that I won Titan and stuff, so I think just so random. How come does PvP not being that much skill involved? Is it too much build order win or the games are too short? What, what, what is it? Um, I think it's uh, about uh, lack of scouting in the early stages because uh, well, the only scouting you get on the, uh, is till the first stalker is out from the opponent. So you, you can see if it's like a free gate or star gate or robo or blink uh, build order. So you have to actually uh, think uh, and predict what your opponent is doing. And uh, when your first observer comes, uh, he most probably have uh, his own observer, so you're like both defending your main to not get scouted. So I think that's, that's the reason why PvP is so random. You really have to predict, that's it. Uh, what Blizzard tried to fix PvP by changing a lot of stuff, uh, changing the floor gate, and uh, I was doing an interview earlier with, I can't remember, another Pro's player, and he was still saying that it's basically still a lot of Forgate. There are some other reliable builds uh, out there, but Forgate is still strong. What, what would you say to Blizzard? What, what, what could you do about this matchup? Uh, well, that's a very, very hard question. I would like to know the answer, so I could like email the Blizzard to do that. But, uh, I, I, I don't know, because it's, uh, I think the warping is, is, is the problem. Like, there's no distance between the mains, like the map doesn't really matter, so you can warp in near your opponent base, even if it's like very huge map like Terminus and stuff, so I think this is the problem, but they can't uh, nerf it because of the other matchups. Yeah, it's a, it's a mechanical uh, thing that... They... Yes. So, um, the playoffs are, uh, uh, are about to be drawn. Uh, who do you want to face and who you don't want? Uh, I can face like anybody. Uh, uh, there are stronger and less stronger people. But uh, I, I can face anybody but not Protoss because uh, I f they really don't feel confident in my PvP. And if it's like PvZ or PvT, uh, I feel okay with that. Alright, and what are your hopes for this tournament? Uh, I, will, I will see tomorrow. You know, now I'm like a little bit of tired and of course I would like to win the event uh, as it will be my first event uh, that I won. But uh, uh, I will try to make my best games uh, as I can and if, even if I lose but I play very good, I will be happy about it. Yeah. How, how would you, you've been uh, this year, you've done uh, quite a lot of events, uh, some uh, second places uh, here and there. Uh, how would you, what was the, what was your, mo what was the best event, which, which is the most proud of? Uh, it will be definitely ESWC. I think it was like the, the best organized event, like you had your own computer, the admins were very helpful, uh, you, you had a lot of food, a lot of drink and, and stuff, just like this dream hack as well. So uh, also the uh, the games were pretty good. I played second 
but I, I'm not really proud of being second, but I, I'm proud that I could beat like the, the people that I was uh, always losing to, like MC, Sokka and Grubby, because of, of my PvP, so that's why I'm happy about it. And uh, which is like a down moment uh, has been this year? I am New York, definitely, when I did it past the group stage. And what's, uh, what's going to be the outlook for 2012? Oh, I'll try, I don't know, I'll try to improve, but uh, I can't say anything so far. Yeah, so getting some uh, some title in your, uh, somewhere and hopefully the, this weekend? Uh, I really hope so. If I can win DreamHack winner, it will be like ma making my dreams come true. But, uh, well, there are a lot of still uh, a lot of still good players, uh, so uh, we'll see tomorrow. Yeah, it's going to be a, a really tough bracket. Uh, some last question. Uh, what, what do you think about Heart of the Swarm? Did you see it? Did uh, you see the units and stuff yeah, like that? Yeah, yeah, I did see the units, but I think Blizzard will change uh, a lot of stuff during that because, well, some of the units are like extremely imba. Some people say, like, I don't know, uh, replicator? Or yeah. I don't know how, how is it called, but you can like copy the units. Uh, there will be a lot of micro stuff coming up, but I really think that Blizzard will change some, some of them because they look like too good. But, you know, the time will show, yeah. show for sure. Do you feel, uh, do you have the idea that the game is coming too soon? Do you, feel, do you have the idea that Wings of Liberty is still not uh, at its full potential yet, not fully discovered yet? Uh, no, no, no. I think like we really, we really should wait to Heart of the Swarm to come. I think uh, it will come even earlier because I think the most important thing to balance uh, the Wings of Liberty so far, we need like additional units. So that's why we're waiting for uh, Heart of the Swarm because the new units will come and I think the, they will balance the game. Well. I don't have any more questions. Do you have any shout outs to the community? Uh, yeah, big shout outs to the community, to all StarCraft 2, uh, for support, and I really yeah, appreciate that. Of course, big thanks to Mouse Sports for sending me over here, and uh, big thanks to our sponsors uh, Intel, Medion, uh, Razer, Sansibar, and. Uh, you got and Gael, and Gael, of course. Yeah, yeah, Gael, yeah of course. Because it's a bad word in German, I think. Yeah, no, so, in Dutch. Do so you know I'm what like, it means? I'm not sure if I should say it or not. So, do you know what it means? Uh, it's in like Dutch? awesome, or not? So yeah, it's, it's not like awesome, but like a bad word of awesome, right? I'll, I'll tell you. I'll tell you. All right. Because I, I really want to know. So because I heard my teacher said that Gael is uh, is a bad word. Uh, it's not that bad a word, but it's it's. Um, I'll tell you. <laughs> All right. <laughs> and the, and the other the people on the internet they uh, they can look it up. <laughs> All right. All right. Thank you, man. Thank you and, very much. Uh, good luck, man. Uh, tomorrow in the, in the brackets. Thank you very much.